In this tutorial I show you how to make a simple bezel setting. We start by importing the 10mm round gem we created in the tutorial before. If you have any text, please delete it. I will show you now how to resize the gem. I change my current layer to organize my work better. First, we create a circle with a 5mm diameter. Then I make sure the quadrant and the end snap is enabled. Select the stone. Then the scale 3D tool. The base point is zero. Then snap to the quadrant or end point of the gem and then to the quadrant or end point of the 5mm circle. Check if the gem is still in the center and has the same proportions as the original stone. Type SELCRV into the command line. This command selects all curves. We can now delete them. Select the shaded mode in the perspective viewport and check the stone again. Next step is to draw the profile of the bezel setting. Select the polyline tool. In the front viewport click on the end or quadrant of the girdle. Switch off the grid snap if it is enabled. Hold the shift key down. This line should be approximately as high as the crown. Left click to create the next section. Type 0.6 into the command line to make this section 0.6 mm long. Hold the shift key to keep it horizontal. Left click to start the next section. This section should be in a slight angle and 1 to 2 mm below the culet. Left click. Type 1 mm into the command line. Hold the shift key. Left click. The next part should be parallel to the angled line. Left click as soon as you reach the pavilion. Switch off the quadrant snap and snap to the end of the polyline. Check in the command line if the profile is a closed curve. Select the revolve tool. Then the profile curve. Press enter. The revolve axis is the Z axis. Select full circle. Watch the wine glass tutorial to learn more about the revolve tool.